Namaste. Today we are going to watch Billy Connolly uh, terrorist attack at Glasgow airport. Must watch. So let's see what is must watch about it. So I, I think so. Billy Connolly is kind of a comedian. So because in this video we can see he is doing a stand up and he is about terrorist attack at Glasgow airport. So these kind of attacks are very sensational or very you know. uh remains in the mind of people so you you have to be very cautious when you are making a joke about it or when you are telling something so we will see what he has to say about it and what it is like okay terrorist attack are very worst thing because in india also has suffered a lot of these so we do also do not like to make joke or joke about it so what will he say and what will he talk about it let's see seriously what i really like about the western countries that they can make the joke about anything like they can make the joke about religion serious topics and we have watched the family guy too uh, where we have saw saw that they they uh, they like to do you know uh, make jokes on the racism and they can they make joke on everything but here this guy is going to be talk about you know terrorist attack but in a funny way so you know that's a very unique thing for me because firstly the we all know that you know terrorist attack is a you know serious topic and like and you uh, that ha, that it is not at all funny still this guy try to make you know uh, make the scenario to be funny so that's the reason i am so much excited to watch this that ha, because it's not at all easy to make a joke about you know serious topics and uh, and obviously about the terrorist attack so i don't know how he you know made the uh, joke about uh, a joke from it but yeah i'm so much excited I will watch this video, and I hope this video is going to be very hilarious. And most importantly, I am a very sensitive person, so I hope that I am not going going to be offended by his jokes because you know these kinds of things are very you know serious issue for me. As I told you earlier, that I am a sensitive person, and I hope you know I will take all his jokes uh, on a fun basis only. So yeah, let's watch the video. Hmm, it will be very very interesting to watch. So let's start the video. Did you see the terrorists in Glasgow? Islamic fellas that just a wee while ago were fucking what were they fucking thinking about? <laughs> Big in terror to Glasgow. <laughs> Bad choice, boys. <laughs> Should have known better than that. They don't mind a bit of terror in Glasgow. They heard you were coming, religious fanatics. They thought, well, oh, I'm not sure about religious fanatics without a fucking football team. What can I do? <laughs> I saw the whole thing in New York on the news. I thought I would need an ambulance. <laughs> I have never laughed like it. Why? Fucking idiots! That whole suicide bomber shit. It's it just what a prick. No. Do you know what I want to see just once? The suicide bomber instructor. Right, lads. Pay attention. I'm only going to show you. <laughs> oh, I'm going to show it once. Yeah. You'll hear a whoosh, and then something will go over your head, resembling flying mints. That'll be me off for the fifty-seven virgins. Fifty-seven fucking virgins you get. My ass. What, what are you going to do with fifty-seven virgins? You just blow your balls off. <laughs> Yeah. Yeah. Here in Glasgow looking for 57 minutes. <laughs> so <laughs> Nice one. I don't get it. The boy's a hero, John Smeaton, and I know him. But since I've met him since and he's a delightful man. He was a baggage handler at the airport. And he was out for a smoke. <laughs> Guys on fire, people beating the 
about the Glasgow airport terrorist attack so I searched about it so it was about a green car that was filled with petrol canisters and everything and they wanted to ram into the terminal so that like the whole thing burns up uh, burns apart and then everybody killed so it was a very different kind of you know terrorist attack it was not uh, a bomb attached and this and that so they were going for it but the what happened was like the car did not blew away and because of that the whole thing now I understand okay so there were people inside and because the car was still burning so other people started hitting them and like he said the joke okay when uh, like you just imagine like you are burning and then there is somebody hitting on your balls so this is what was happening with those terrorists so he, that was the moment where he said like okay there, there are some moments when you feel like this is my city 
these are my people yeah. this is what happens and you know this happens like even i live in uh, gujarat and surat so if I, even if if you compare the whole india also if like if there is one indian who has done something very good at some other place then we are like this is what we call indians and this is what we, what it is and that's what he was saying that uh, you do not come to glasgow and he was like Scot- uh, glasgow is in uh, scotland so he was like scottish people are like this only if you come you will get fucked you cannot just come here and attack us and the way he was telling it he was like when i saw this news in america i wa- i called it i wanted an ambulance because i was laughing so hard because he was like everything was a joke for him like how they came in because it was a serious condition how they came in and th- did all this but yes and even that joke was about the 57 virgins he was like 57 virgins you have blown your balls off how can you even enjoy those virgins so it was a hilarious one to watch and really we have to say that this guy is so brave because he was you know saying the truth and it's so hard you know to say the truth uh, in front of the camera because you know a lot of uh, in front of the audience basically because a lot of people are watching you and many of them get offended by your you know comment so it's uh, difficult but this guy you know uh, this guy said everything you know uh, which was true so that's the reason i really like him and on the other side he is so so hilarious he basically on the same uh, on one side he was angry he was you know frustrated on the other side the way he was doing comedy comedy was so hilarious to watch it and it you know uh, and we have to say that he, he is a, he was a gem and uh, there are literally few uh, stand up comedians like him and it was our first time when we watched it. and we have to say that uh that we uh, both of uh, uh, both of us uh, uh, enjoyed his videos so much and i hope we're going to watch his more and more videos and people were also enjoying his you know uh, stand up everybody was laughing and the way he was you know taking out his frustration was you know hilarious to see it was like it's not like he was just taking out his frustration it it, it was like that he is jo he is so tired by the things which is going on his country and he is just taking out out taking just he is just taking out that thing thing so the way he was you know speaking up was so so hilarious to watch so yeah i really enjoy this one mm, and the thing is it is a hilarious one but i would expect a better quality video next time because this one was like okay it was shot from the camera from the audience and i searched for it and there are no like original versions of it there should have been because he is very very hilarious so what do you guys think about it do let us know in the comment section below so do like share and subscribe bye, bye.